Hi, my name is Chris Shelton and I'm a Qigong master and today what I'd like to do is like to discuss how to get rid of shock, especially the shock of suddenly losing a loved one. Now we're getting into the holiday season and what makes it even worse is if you lost somebody during the holidays because you have this constant memory of, oh, it was Thanksgiving and my friend passed away or it was Christmas and my mother passed away or whatever. So anytime somebody suddenly leaves us, it's always a shock to the system. So it's not only around the holidays, just that I notice with a lot of my clients and patients, it's exemplified with the holidays itself. So a very simple Qigong practice that you could do is a healing sound for the kidneys. And the healing sound for the kidneys is Fu. So the negative emotions of fear and shock get stuck in the kidneys. So all we're going to do is you can place the hands on the kidneys on the low back. We're going to imagine a blue cloud filling up into the kidneys. And then as you inhale, I got to imagine that circumstance or that person. I'm going to feel the shock from them suddenly departing. And then I'm going to exhale, making the sound. Inhale. And again, inhale. And you can do the sound underneath your breath as well. So inhaling. And as you exhale, making the foo sound, allowing for that shock of that person leaving, going away from the body like a dark cloud. So that shock or trauma that was created for you for the sudden loss, allow for that to leave, going away from the body and down deep into the ground, allowing for the positive virtue of wisdom to take the place of the sudden loss and the shock. So you can do it with your hands at your side. You also can do it with your eyes open. So if you're feeling any of these emotions, especially the emotions of shock around losing a loved one or a friend suddenly, um, or even if you knew that they were sick for a long time and they suddenly are gone, that kind of shock to the system creates PTSD, which creates all kinds of inflammation and, and possibility for chronic disease. So a very simple Qigong practice to do, and you can take it with you anywhere.